Hey guys, today I'm working with a Kenmore washer and electric dryer. And right now I've got this washer going, filling up with a pretty heavy super capacity plus load. Some jeans and towels down in there. So we've got it going on the ultra clean cycle. Got it set to fast, fast. And uh, of course all of these been tested out and large load here. So now the washer gets a 28 point inspection, the dryer gets a 22 point inspection, everything electrical, mechanical, it all gets checked and everything has to work perfectly before it gets listed up for sale, or before it leaves my care. So all of this has already been tested, this machine has been thoroughly cleaned inside and out. And then I do this video as if you were standing here yourself testing it out so you can see everything works great. Um, that's how I like to shop, so that's how I like to sell my items, I like to know when I get it home, plug it in, everything's going to work good. So, um, we'll go ahead and let it finish filling up with water. We'll come back, I'll show you that it agitates correctly, drains the water out, and then we'll be on to the final spin cycle. You can see that it spins nice and fast, smooth, and all that. And then we'll move those clothes over to the dryer and show you the dryer. So, we'll come back. All right, so we moved into the washing portion. You see, it's got a nice, strong agitation there. You notice how this only moves in one direction here. That's how that's supposed to work. Should not be able to move the uh, counterclockwise direction. So you know that's working properly. So we'll let it finish up the wash cycle. Um, I'll show you that it's draining on the rinse cycle and then we'll be on the final spin. All right, and you can hear it draining out that water. Nice and fast. And I won't open this and interrupt its draining cycle because from here it switches over. It's in a neutral cycle right now, which allows it to drain without spinning. And then it'll switch over and start spinning on the first um, rinse spin, if you will. So I'm not going to lift the lid up, but you can hear the water draining out just fine. All right, and we moved into the final spin cycle. It's moving nice and fast. You can see in here that. Sounds great. And I'm going to lift this lid up. The lid switch will kick in and it'll shut it down, but that way you can see that it is spinning nice and fast on this uh, pretty heavy load here. There you go. Comes to a stop. A nice safety feature there if this ever gets opened up. We'll let that go ahead and finish up. And we'll show you the dryer. All right, now I've got those clothes moved over to the dryer. We'll show you that here real quick. Got that. Pretty heavy load in there, and you can see the light works and all that. Just hit it on time dry with high heat, hit go. See it's nice, smooth operation, sounds great. And then I always refinish the top of these if they need it. They always get little can marks and stuff from people setting stuff on top of them. So check the pictures and you'll see that it all looks like new again. I also want to show you that it is heating like it's supposed to. So right in between those two red dots, it'll take its surface temperature measurement. Can I see a difference between the floor and the top of the machine here? Open it up and shoot it right inside the heating element tube. You see plenty of heat coming out of that tube. So the tube can get pretty hot. Heating element is behind this panel here, so the heat comes up out the tube, and the inside of your dryer is only going to heat up from about 95 to 195 to get those clothes dry. And that's just going to depend on what setting you have it here, because you do have a low delicate setting. You also have air dry for stuff that you tumble dry. But otherwise, we'll go high heat. We'll let that finish up. Now you know everything works perfect. You get it home, plug it in, you'll be good to go. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out. And I do appreciate you taking the time to watch this video. Thanks and have a great day.